Eastern PA Weather Authority meteorologist Bobby Marchich here with your outlook for April 17th, 2017. We're going to have a cold front that's going to be moving through very early this morning, and that's going to give the uh, area some clouds and maybe a few leftover showers. Uh, very isolated, but uh, we all have mostly cloudy skies in the morning. They're going to give way to partly cloudy skies in the afternoon today until this front finally clears and moves off to the southeast. Not a big deal here shown with the showers, but if we do look at the 3-kilometer NAM at 8 a.m., you still see some scattered activity here over mainly uh, southeast PA at this point, and that will move eastward uh, by 10 o'clock. You see it's starting to fall apart here at 11. It's just about all gone, so it's just early this morning with a little wave of showers possible, uh, very light showers, and then we'll have mostly cloudy skies elsewhere giving way to partly cloudy skies this afternoon. You can see that here and absolutely nothing across the coverage area. We will also get temperatures up, uh, even though the cold front's coming through in the morning. We're still going to have temperatures not nearly as warm as they were yesterday, but this is still very warm for this time of year. Temperatures reaching the 70-degree mark or higher in a lot of places, so we will have a very comfortable afternoon with wind shifting to the northwest once that front clears. So this front is going to sift off to the south, and we'll be out of our hair, uh, setting up a mostly sunny Tuesday as high pressure takes, uh, takes over, takes control. And uh, high pressure sitting right here over eastern New England at this point. But we will have mostly sunny skies here on Tuesday. Again, not as quite as warm on Tuesday as it was uh, that, that it will be today. But uh, still not going back that far. We're talking about middle 60s for highs instead. Uh, which is still you know, still good uh, temperature for this time of year. Going a little bit forward from this, we do get into an unsettled pattern as we get into Wednesday of a cold front approaching from the northwest. Or maybe a, a warm front associated with this as gives us some advanced uh, shower activity, but I think most of this activity uh, comes in late in the day on Monday or on Wednesday, I'm sorry, and also Wednesday overnight. So you can see, and then generally for the central and northern locations, it's showing for that uh, <clears throat> for that shower activity. So not a lot of rain with this, but then we have a, a little bit of a break after some early showers Wednesday morning, and then we have late in the day another cold front that's going to approach with association with this low pressure off to the north. This cold front will have some more scattered, widely scattered showers and perhaps a thunderstorm here on Thursday. So, again, not a lot of total rain with this. If you're looking for uh, some, some appreciable rainfall, you're not going to get it this week, it looks like. Models have been backing off of that steadily as we've uh, gone through time. We, look, we looked at this as uh, last looked at this before we did the weekend forecast video. And uh, that was a couple days ago. It looked a little bit more robust than this. It's starting to, as we get closer to it in time, it's starting to uh, become less and less impressive with each uh, with each run here. So as we get into Friday, uh, morning clouds giving way to sun. This system's going to be pulling away. And then we have a, a, a partly cloudy day here on Saturday. Another system down to, to the southwest will be making its way toward the area. A little uncertain at how far north this gets. The GFS is a little bit further south with this and just kind of slides this off to the south it keeps us dry this weekend uh european model and others are bringing this up further north like you can see here and bringing some shower activity uh it's uncertain how this evolves it's kind of goofy how it's revolving here and it looks like it's trying to redevelop further south anyway but we will have the opportunity for some uh, for at least mostly cloudy skies and the opportunity for some scattered showers on sunday i wouldn't bank on that yet just yet though because we are talking about uh, you know, we're, we're going out pretty far and now going into early next week. So, of course, this will change and evolve many times in the times uh, in, the, in the coming days. But uh, we saw how this one here uh, that's coming up on uh, the end of this week has already started to fizzle and really isn't producing much. So I want to get too excited about any rain chances as we get into later in the weekend. We'll address that as we get further into the week. I'm Eastern PA Weather Authority meteorologist Bobby Martrich. That is your outlook for April 17th, 2017. Have a great Monday.